Hello everyone, welcome to Manari TV. Why is the piece like this? Sabadna! Aka Jindu! Yes, sir. Why is that piece like this? Did you have to do anything? Why is the piece like this? What is wrong? I had a terrible dream last night. In that dream, I saw myself in an open place, surrounded by bush. Immediately, your father appeared from nowhere, asking me to die and give way for a new leaf to spring forth. As we were still battling in Proverbs, your father, God of Jesus, your head God forbid, I command in the name of Jesus. I command in the name of Jesus. Nobody will come off your head. It will never be. Never. Hey, what kind of terrible dream was that? I don't know. I don't know. Hey. Mama, are you sure that this has nothing to do with your inability to give Papa his son? Are you sure? I thought so because in that dream he said that when a tree grows up to its height, it has to give way for another one to come up. Hmm. The implied meaning is that father wants to get another woman that will help be his son for him. Hmm. But you born and walk him. Just have the dreamer. Or on, Rob. Don't mind that, Mama. We all know that Papa is still very much in love with you. He loves you very well. He will never. It can't happen. All we need to do now is to go inside the house and pray. Bind. Cancel all the evil. We should go and pray very well. Hmm? But where is Father now? He has gone out. I'm sorry to bother you. My name is Anele, the, the son of the chief spokesman of uh, Zule, the kingdom. And uh, I'd like to know your names, especially you. In that case, let me excuse you guys. No, uh, can I at least know your name? Oh, I'm Samadina. Samadina Olori. Nice to meet you, Samadina. And what about you, Angel? My name is Chinelo, the first daughter of Chinelo. So Madna is my immediate younger sister. Ah, that means your mother must be an angel, must be a queen. So, um, you're very pretty and... Uh, 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 please, please. Uh, this firewood is very heavy, okay? I, I have to go now. Can I at least have your phone number? It doesn't work that way, Mr. Man. Bye. Uh. Uh. 
I am the only son of my late father. And when I die, the Nui family will be forgotten. I need a son. I need a son that will replace me when I die and carry on the family name. Yes, I have wonderful daughters, but one day they will all get married and they will all leave. Yes, they will leave, all of them. Papa, dinner is ready. Papa, Papa, food is ready. Thank you, Papa. I can't. He said no. Oh, I can't. He didn't go to school today. No. School. No. Where is your father? You mean my father? Where? Oh. Ah. Hey. 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 Welcome. 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 No. No. I can't. So you uh, still didn't go to school after I warned you. Eventually, you didn't go to school. But Papa, I told you that our school is on strike. Huh? You say strike? What? Did you hear that? My daughter went to school. That's why I asked you. Did you hear that? Uh, uh, so, sorry, Papa. You know that my sister that I told you. Don't talk to him. Don't talk. Don't talk. To him. He, he, he died. So my class is on strike. Will you go and get the chair? Sit before you begin to talk to rubbish. Huh? You just imagine. Yeah? Welcome, welcome. It's not in my. Yeah. It's all well. Say one name. Let's go. Uh, uh, one name. I've come to see you. What you is? must help me. You see, I need a son. A son. Uh, anyway. What type of son do you want? Now I'm asking this because you have seen the type I have at home. You saw how he behaves. That's how he behaves. So is it that type you want or a different type of son? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let me give cola first. What if you can enjoy it? Okay. Papa, Papa, grab the seat. Papa. Papa, be seat. Go, go, go. Hmm? Get out before I'm walking. Hmm? I get to the target for that. Look after me. Look, have you seen what I was talking about? Is it this type of song you want or a different type? Let me know. Come on. You can see what I've been going through. So, how are you? I'm okay. Okay, I know you're in a hurry. I don't want to. I wouldn't want to waste your time. But please, um, can you help me with your sister's number? Listen to me. I mean well for her. Mm, but you know, it's not right for me to do that. My sister may not be happy on getting to me. And who would tell her? Would you, would you tell her? Because I, I would not tell her. So, the truth is, I'm desperate, kind of, and I'm looking for a wife. It's okay. I will give you so that you stop watering me and doing <laughs> So, so, thank you. Thank you. 
Thank you very much. Yeah? Don't worry, I'll appreciate you when I come around, okay? Get who I saw on the way. Why I said, who? Oh. I met an error on my way back home. Like again, he requested for your number and I... You gave Anneli my number. Why did you do that? I made it clear that I don't want to have anything to do with all the men in this village. I told you that. Come to think of it, Sister Nero. Anneli is a son to a chief spokesman. He's rich and handsome too. Most importantly, he revealed that he's looking for a wife. Not this boyfriend and girlfriend thing. Just admit that you are wrong and stop blabbing. Honestly, I'm, I'm not, I'm, I don't like doing it like that. I'm sorry. Smile for me. I'll hit you in this thing now. Barrier with the onions, the food is always right. Yes, Father. You call this meeting. Run. I just want to inform everyone that the vacation period is over. So I'll be going back to the campus in a few days' time. So, Madina, my daughter, you are no longer in your first year. You know what to do. The most important things are your prayers. Hmm? Thank you, Mother. So, Papa, what do you have to say? Hmm? Oh, <laughs> that. I know where you're going. Is it no money? Uh, no problem, no problem. I will run around as usual, and uh, you can be sure you are going back to school. Hmm? Your school fees are assured. Mm. You want yours, huh? Yes. So, okay. Let me go and rest. Papa, Papa, wait, please. Please, let, 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 let's pray for her before. Let's pray together for her, please. I mean, pray. Ikuchago. Prayer warrior, Ikuchago. Good, now. Let me tell you. Pray very well. Pray to God. Pray to God to make this woman a mother. Let her give me a male child. Hmm. Papa is not happy with the family. We all know his problem. So, Madina, my daughter, you owe a lot to your sister. Both of you gained admission the same year. But because of money, she had to step down for you. She has shown you a very big love as an elder sister. Okay, mother. Let me just make this promise. I will never disappoint any of you. Thank you, my dear. Yeah. 
Baby, I've been looking for you everywhere in the class, even on daddy's seats. Where have you been? Eh? Huh? Hmm? How many times did I warn you not to bother me after, after school this Mr. How many times? I can't see. Why have you chosen to waste your life just like that? You have never failed to take the last position in the class. And you always take the last position. This time, even next time. <laughs> I did not talk to you, and even you! Mm. Sorry, see, respect yourself, huh? Uh, sorry. Akajendo, <laughs> uh, um, uh, uh, huh? hear me out. I love you so much. There is even a match in our names. Akanti and Akajendo. Aka, Aka. Both of them have Aka as the initial. Please, love me back. Huh? Yeah, just this come back and love me! Uh. See, if you don't come and love me, I, I, I will kill myself! Mm -mm. I will kill myself! I will shoot myself with this catapult. There's no stone here. Come back and love me! Uh. Come back and love me! Uh. Mm -mm. I will shoot myself! Love me! Uh. Love me! Uh. Sister, Sister, what's in God's name? Ah, Aka, you are back from school. Yes, welcome. What is bothering you? Is it not this Anneli of a man? He has not given me a moment of rest since Somadna gave him my phone number. Is that? Hmm. Sister, some told me that Anneli is a chief spokesman's son from a very big kingdom. God has really favored you, sister. I just advise you to tell her mother, because for me, I like him. <laughs> My advisor, <laughs> go in and eat your food. Okay, if you say so, where is Sister Sovadina? She's sleeping. Okay, yeah. Thank you. All right. Hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. My dear. Since Papa has refused to come out and say at least bye bye to me, please help me to tell him that I love him. Tell him that the family loves him and Jesus loves him. Don't worry, my daughter. With time, everything will be alright. Hmm? Sister, thank you so much. I love you a lot. Don't worry. Hmm? Just promise me that you'll be very serious with your books and very strong in prayers. Okay. Aga, mm. I expect an excellent result from you this time. <clears throat> that is if I can't allow her to eat. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind, Sister Chinelo. I can't see this one today, okay? I'll do it. So, that little son of a chain, what is still threatening your life, following you all around? Mm. Don't worry. His own case is, is just. A minor case, a camo, a camo case called nonsense. Don't worry. Oh, my dear. Just read. Hmm? Don't allow anything to anything to distract you. It's your lawyer. Let today be the last. You try what you did. A child who will take after me when I'm no more. Do we have any? Ajundo, don't talk like this. You are not a child. You're my child. You will kill a young one. No, don't behave this, this way next time, please. Don't. Leave that in the chair, Wabo. You are far better than this man. After all, you have a male child, a half son. I can't take. I'm not boasting about it. Asundo, don't do this. You don't next time, please. You go on my Huh? 
Suppose that your views must be respected at every meeting. Why? Oh, do you want to know? I want to know. It is because I have a male child who will take after me when I'm no more. Do you have any? I don't know. Don't talk like this. You are not a child. You are matured. You will kill a young one. No, don't behave this, this way next time, please. Don't. Leave that in the chair, Wabo. You are far better than this man. After all, you have a male child, a half son. I can't take. I'm not boasting about it. Eh? Hey, do? Don't do this next time. Of song do you want? Now I'm asking this because you have seen the type I have at home. You saw how he behaves. That's how he behaves. So is it that type you want or a different type of song? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let me give Kola first. One of the things I can Okay. Get out before I walk out of the garden. Look, have you seen what I was talking about? Is it this type of song you want or a different type? Let me know. Come on. You can see what I've been going through. Oh, baby, I want to say thank you for accepting me. I promise to be the best friend you've ever had. You're welcome. All I need from you is to be good, okay? Cross my heart. <laughs> I'll be good. What of your parents? They are good. They are great. Don't worry. Very soon you get to meet them. Okay. Very soon. And what about my very good friend, my accomplice, Sumadina? She has gone back to school. Oh, that's nice. Mm. That's nice. Um, I, I think I should be going now. I'll see you on Sunday, like I promised. All right. Before you leave, 
got you something. It's all ways. Especially just for you. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Thanks. You're welcome. You're welcome. Okay. If a child shoots an arrow that reaches the top of a palm tree, then it must be an elder that carved it for you. Uh, um, uh, um, wise one. Hold it. I know why you are here. If the drum is not made, it is the fault of the masters. But if the drum is made and is not beaten, it is the fault of the boys. I know why you are here. You need a song. Well, why <laughs> one? You're you're right. Yes. <laughs> that is true, very, very true. Huh? You see, I am like uh, the ant. The ant that chooses to gather its food during the dry season. Because rainy season is not the time to do it. Yes, that's what I am. Huh? Wise one. Wise one. You must help me. You must help me before it's too late. Go and fetch your wife. Makanovumpula kade kengugu. Go and come with your wife. That is it. Le Betty. Sit down. Thank you, sit down. I think you don't have to Let me see. I went to see a Chieteka. I want you to ask me why I went to see a Chieteka. <laughs> Nai, why did you go to see that man? I went to see a Chieteka. Because you have not given me a male child. Okay. Emu beye, emu ta beye. Cha cha. Nai, you, you went to see that man. As a Christian, I am highly disappointed in you. I am highly disappointed in you. Disappointed in you. Ah. 
Ah, me escucha vos. Escucha la ¿Eh? Le ve que. Echi este ca. Told me that he wants both of us in his shrine tomorrow. So, you wake up in the morning tomorrow. Then you and I will go to see Echeteka. You and I, me and you, we will go tomorrow. God forbid. I cannot go there. It is against my Christian faith. I can't go with you. Fair, fair, fair. I can't. Fair, fair, fair. You go? You put go. Tomorrow, you must get prepared. You and I must go to Echeteka. Oto hands is where? Come here to where me? No, it's not possible. I'm not going with you. I cannot go with you. I can't. If somebody will ever do me, I cannot go. Is that so? Yes. Somebody is going to cut off that your neck for you. Come on, cut it. Somebody will cut that your neck off for you. If you don't have knife, I can equally go to the market. And buy a very big machete for you. It will happen. Come and bundle me to that place. Come and bundle me. Nonsense. I brought you good and bad news. The good news there is that you have been chosen to be an excellent case. He gives some of you. That's the good news. We can resume. Name it And uh, the bad news? The bad news is that if within one year you do not get a male child, the entire thing will get away from you. You lose everything in its entirety. That's the bad news. That's the tradition, you're right. You see, um, your wool is yet to die, so I, uh, I guess I still have enough time to present the kingdom with a male child. Yes, but uh, if, I, if I don't do that... By the way, what did Echeteka say on this issue? <sighs> Echeteka said that my wife must return to the shrine with me. I told her. She refused. She said she is a Christian. So that's that's what is uh, that's the problem there. I'm confused. I don't know what to do. Mm. Lawyer, I want you to take note of the fact that if you do not have a marriage child in one year, you will lose everything. With that in mind, say, choose a second wife. Eh? For the sake of a male child. Don't forget the powers, the influences, the benefits that will accrue to you. Hey, goodies from government, we make meetings in the international forum. Awards, things coming from within our community and from outside for you because of that business. So go straight and take a second wife. I don't have much to say more than this. I am going. And I'm, I'm going. And I'm away. <coughs> I'm about to. <laughs> uh, 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 because of Papa again. <laughs> Your father threatened to throw me out of the house if I didn't follow him to this tribe. <laughs> and if I follow him to see Cheteka, <laughs> how am I going to face my fellow Christian? I don't know why he insists that you follow him to see Cheteka. I don't know why. <laughs> how do I walk to the altar to take the Holy Communion? Oh, God. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Be strong. I know that the Almighty God that we serve will not let us down. He will not. 
and let me tell you something. If Papa insists that you leave this house, I promise you that all of us will go with you. Please. Pray to do. We will go to your parents' house. Yes. We will go and stay with Grandma. It's okay. Stop crying. It's okay, Mama. Stop crying. Stop, please. <laughs> Great one. Great Divya. Oloye, where is your wife? I asked you to come with her. I tried to convince her, but she refused. What should I do? She must appear nude. Maka neme ngwa ngwa, eme ga roda ji. She must obey. She must! She must! I say she must! Akanti, I have told you times down number, it can never work out between us. What is your problem? Must you give me a headache after every school dismissal? Must you? What I ask from you is just a little chance, very small like this. Eh? And I will show you that I love and care for you. Please. I will not. You've had it now. Please, I Don't love you. Don't disturb me again. I love you. I, I can't love you. leave me alone. Please, I love you. Please. I can't leave me Please, alone Please, I now. love you. Love me back. I can't leave you me alone. You must love you. Please. Leave me alone now. I can't leave me alone. You must I'm, love I'm me. not to believe you. Please, love me. I can't love leave me. me alone. Love me. After now, it's good today. Um, yeah, your boyfriend, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> I, I told you that I can't do that. Like that. <laughs> you just stop him. You haven't to be seen like <laughs> Okay. It's your time. It's your time. Both of you. <laughs> Okay, okay, you think that I will change my mind? I cannot. I cannot be such a change again. Don't change your mind! I won't. Your days are over. Let it be, let it be. You are going now. You cannot see that other butter. I am going now. Oh yeah. Okay. Take your things and move. I will. Go. I will. Go. I will. Ah! Yes. Can you go? What is it? What is that? Mama? Papa? What is it? What, what, what is going on? Your father has asked me to leave his house. Unless I visit a check that with him. And I cannot go. I can't. What? Papa? Mama? I knew it would come to this. I knew it. I tell you what. We had already packed our things, waiting for this day to come. Since you have sent our mother packing, we, your girls, must go with her. Yes! <laughs> so, you just say this thing so that I will start panicking. Yeah? You could go. Oh, the ma. Now, hear my own. I have sent your mother packing. And you just told me that you, you, you girls, you have, you have, you have, you had earlier packed your, your luggages ready. You got them ready. You have made this easy for me. Very easy. Yeah? I was actually hitting my head here and there, uh, trying to fathom how I would send three of you, all of you packing. 
But now you've made things easy for me. One, two, three of girls. Pack your things and go. Follow your mother. Go. Ah, can't wait. What is it? Agony. I tell you something, Father. You will surely regret this. I know that somebody somewhere is feeding you with a strong advice. You weren't like this before. Father, this is unbelievable. I mean, this is madness. How can you send your entire family back in because of some sort of stupid, ridiculous, traditional title? Father, think, Father, think. Hey, hey, hey. Don't even call it stupid title. That title is not stupid, though. That title is not ridiculous. That title has meaning. It has a lot of meaning. In fact, the only thing that doesn't have a meaning here is, is, is the girls. Don't you see it? Chinelo, can't you see it? It's open. Yeah? I am a man. I need a male child. How about what are we even talking about? Yeah? See me a man like me. I'm living with one, two, three, three girls plus this one, four. All alone in this house. I need a male child. Three girls you want to pee, you stay like this and pee. I want at least one man that will stand like this and pee. Father, can ah. you listen to yourself? Can you just hear yourself talk? Let's go inside and pick Go inside and pick your things and go. You make it easy for me. Hey. Hey, hey. If you are their if, if you are their friend, eh? Oh, you have a car key. Take all these in and put them in the boot of your car, carry them and go. Don't disturb me. Oh, give me. I'm going to make a car. Give me the car. What's left of me to fade out? It's gone. But you said you can't bear to see me fly. This is not what we signed up for. But please, I will to come in and Freedom, Mama, woman, that was what happened. He said I must do as the Chedeka decreed by following him to the shrine. Mbano, Mbano, that is so wicked of my in law. He wasn't like that in the beginning. Hmm? Honestly, Mama, my father just changed overnight because of his male child issue. I'm so, so disappointed in you. Very disappointed. Oh, my children, all shall be well. Hmm? All of you should go inside and relax. Here is your home also. Hmm? Jim, Mom. Haka. Feel at home. Thank you, Grandma. I've been deliberating over this whole issue. It is clear that if we just fold our arms and watch things go the way it's going, we are doomed. How do you mean, Sister Sol? Let's be reasonable enough. Now that we've left the house, Papa's next plan will be to get another woman 
that will definitely be a children for him. And once that is done, our chances of going back to our father's house is gone. And it won't be long. The people of this community will start seeing us differently. So, why not go straight to the point? Let me ask you, Sister Tim. Should Daniel decide to come for your marriage introduction tomorrow? Is he here you expect him to come? The same thing is applicable to you and I. So, we must do everything possible to return to our father's house. Otherwise, we we'll have no future secured for ourselves. So, you have a point. But, since Papa is bent on having a male child, which Mama has not been able to give to him, what do we do? You don't expect her to leave our mother here and go back to Zam, our fatherland. Honestly, I, I am so confused. And my school? How do I even cope? Grandma has promised to visit Papa. But after everything, if Papa does not change his decision, we'll get you another school here. I have an idea now. Aka, okay. come on, come on. Make sure that grandma doesn't know. Mama, your children have decided not to fold their arms. And what things go wrong before us? I've come up with a very good idea. What Papa wants is a male child in our family. In addition, the rule of the title he seeks states that the chair in question should have a male child born in that same family, not necessarily from the man himself. You are right, my child. You are right. Yes, you are right. Hope I'm doing the right thing. I just sent my entire family away. And therefore gone. And my friend advises that I marry another wife. I love my daughters and my wife. I love her too. Yes, but I need a son. I need it. I need the title. I need this. But you want the money. Yeah. I need a son. My family. Oh my God. I'm confused. I don't want to do anything I'm going to regret. Oloye, my in-law, I have come to know what my daughter did to deserve all this unfair treatment from you. Mm. Um, in-law, they will. I think you know. You're welcome. Um, <laughs> you see this is your daughter? You see this is your daughter? She has skeletons in her cupboard. Ask her. 
How do you mean? Madam. Etia teka de dibia gave us a simple solution to solve our problem. What did she do? She stubbornly refused to accept. Stubbornly refused to do what Etia teka, the simple thing Etia teka asked her to do. What does this imply? It implies he does not want to give me a male child. Mm. That's it. Nay. <laughs> Why are you talking like this now, eh? God knows that I have been trying my best. Praying and fasting. Asking God to give us a male child. Ikuchano. <laughs> Ikuchano. Nekene, look at her. Crocodile tears. Look at her shedding crocodile tears. I am not interested in those crocodile tears, my friend. We are talking about a male child here, and you're coming here to shed uh, crocodile tears. Can't even name it. What am I even doing here, Mama? I was going to the palace when you came, and uh, actually, I had to sit. I had to stay back uh, because it is you. Huh? Um, unfortunately, I've locked. Uh, uh, the door. The door is locked. All the doors are locked. You know I'm living alone now. Huh? Um, I will go. Huh? But my in-law, it is unfair. It is unfair. God is watching you. Hey, God is watching. Hey. It is unfair. God is watching. God watch me. Oh. Fine girl. <laughs> The mood is not nice this uh, morning. What's going on? I know it has to do with your family and the recent happenings, but I've, I've told you not to worry that everything will be okay. I'm sorry, honey. Did you just call me by my name? That's a first. You haven't done that before. All right, just hold on a second. Baby, will you marry me, please? Don't say no. It came late. I'm sorry, I cannot marry you. And please, don't ask me why, because you want to understand. Hell no, I'll understand. But you say you loved me. I love you very much, Alan. You are the best thing that has ever happened to me. You are so gentle. That's so nice. I'm so to forget about me completely. It was after this day, many things will go wrong to put things in Babe, it's, you're speaking in parables. I don't, I don't understand. I wish you were in search of your right woman. Please. Nello. Don't bother waiting for me because you'll never see me again. Ichi Olui has sent his family back in. They say that he said he needs a son that will contain his family name. My sister, spare me that. His main reason is clear. It is because of his newly attained position, which goes with a higher honor in this kingdom. You mean the traditional prime minister? Yes, of course. Once Ono Wu dies, Ichi Olui will take over from him. But in this community, an Ichi without a male child cannot acquire such title. 
Why didn't the ghost choose him knowing fully where he did not have a main issue? Do I know? The Ichies suggested that he should marry another woman for the same purpose. But why did these elders do it this way? Ichie Uwo is still alive. At least they should have waited for him to die. You speak as if you are not in this village. It has always been so. They don't wait for the guy to be and to die because they're letting him know. Okay, come on, stand anyway. Okay, my sister, I'll be late for the garden. So see you later. Okay? Take care. Adam, 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 There is something I've been thinking about. It's been bothering me a lot, but I've been thinking about this lately. Something like what? Williams. I say, I need to settle down. I am not getting any younger, Williams. You, I don't know if you understand what I'm trying to say here. I need to settle down. You see this life we have been living, sleeping with different women, jumping from one location to the other, from one bed to the other. It is not an achievement. <laughs> My man, uh, sometimes uh, they confuse me. Oh. See, see who is talking. Were well, you not the one that told me that you can't wait to club this weekend? And that you complete the race by picking the sweetest looking girl at the club? Yes, William, I, I sincerely do not um, disagree saying that. I, I said it. But you see, after this weekend, I'm done. I will lie low. I am done, absolutely. Man, <laughs> see, I honestly speaking, I, I can see some seriousness in your eyes. Yeah. I am not getting any younger. My parents are on my neck. Besides, I am the first mm -hmm. son in my family. You know what that means, my brother? You're on point, bro. <laughs> Come on, let's drink to this, man. You're on point, bro. Let's drink to this shit. Bob, bad girl. Bad girl. Please get us some bottles. Obalo Juku. Hero, okay? Making you a hero, bro. <laughs> get, out, get out of here. Ah, Mama. You are welcome. Thank you, Mama. Uh, please, Mama, I'd, I'd like to see um, Chinelo. 
chinelo chinelo is not around she has traveled i advise you to keep her memories aside uh, and move on with your life that's the problem here everybody seems to be hiding something from me the last time i asked her she said some strange things <sighs> my dear please forget about her we do appreciate all the things that you have been doing for this family but the situation at hand we cannot help Mabikoni. Well, you don't seem to understand me. I love Chinilo so much. And I told her, I want to marry her. That's all. Anele, your talk is reminding me of things that I don't want to remember. Please. I advise you for you to look for somebody to marry. Because you may not see Chinilo again. Even now. I don't want to go further on this. Yes. Ah, ah. Do they even understand that this is about marriage? We are talking about marriage and this... Mama, come back! Uh -uh. This is marriage you are talking about. This is not a joke. Please stop. You are crying again. What is it? So we are back. How we are lectures? Fine. But why are you crying? I think I'm missing her name. Sister, look at me. Are you really sure you can do this? I told you if you can't, I can do it. Moreover, you have sacrificed a lot for this family. You believe it's my turn now. I will do it. You will soon graduate. You are an asset to this family. I will do it. Okay? Are you sure? I'm certain. I promise you I won't cry again. I won't? Okay. We'll be going to the club this weekend. I've already told you the way it's done. No. Uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, I was I was going to your house. Mm. I see. Your father gave you a message to deliver. My father, my father, my father. Uh, no, no, no. My father did not give me any message. Uh, actually, I was uh, coming to find out something from you. I wanted to know where your daughters are, uh, more especially the beautiful one, uh, because you know I heard you drove them away. Uh, no, it's main one. Uh, I have a message for Akajindo from school. From school. Uh, from school. From school. From school. You give me the message, and I will deliver it to her. Ah, no, no. It's, uh, the message is not for old people like you. Uh, it's for Akajindu alone because uh, uh, it's very important. Listen, listen, listen. It's uh, my catapult, you're cutting it. Now, listen. You don't stand on my way 
any day. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? Yes, yes. See me? You pass. Don't to give me an insulting message. No, 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 yes, no, yes. The message is, is important to Now you run home. Look at you. Button up! Hey, what's up, baby? How are you doing with your wife and your wife? Oh my god. My dear, sincerely right now, you are the most beautiful girl in the whole universe. God bless you, mother, baby. <laughs> mm. Wow. Oh, sweetheart, um, you see, actually, I'd love to have you tonight. That is, if you're not here with someone. <laughs> yes, I, um, I'm alone. I, I, I just came to have fun. Wow, that sounds good. Then in that case, you go with me tonight. Oh. That's okay. Okay, how much will that cost me? <laughs> you know. You see, uh, money won't be the problem. I just came here to have fun. So I'm enjoying myself. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I like that. Oh, come on, cheers to us. Come on, I'm talking to you. What is it? Will you let me? Come on, stop being harsh. Are you not here for? I'm not here for anything. Please, let me be. Boys, no money, no loss. Boys are very big boys. You don't fuck up. You want from boss. That's all I don't boss. Why so bad like us? You can't leave us. You don't come boss. Girls are very surplus. You don't leave us. You won't come floss. Now money don't loss. You follow up for us, spend your money on top of us. Let me say we don't come back to go. You follow up for us, spend your money on top of us. Let me say we don't come back to the. I just see my man money on the do to sugar. Oh, who they blow you, you can they do to sugar. Chief of that titles, I can't stay with my nose. You want to go to World Cup. Now, what for you, big bros? And you know, practice. They do like they man this. What the funny tactics? I thought she wants this, this. Chief of that titles. You don't drop dice. You won't come fight. But God they like. Oh, I'm coming. Come here, baby. Come here. <laughs> Come here. Wait, 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 wait. What's that for? What? The thing in your hand. It's a condom for crying out loud, and I believe you know what it is used for. <gasps> Come on, baby. I don't need it. Yes. I told you before that I want to enjoy the pleasure in sex. Listen, I've never had sex in my life before. And now that I've decided to do it, I want to enjoy myself. I want to enjoy it. Please, I don't need that. You want me to? Go to your Burundi without a passport. I mean, you want me to do it wrong? You want me to do it bare? Yes. Without? Hey, I should be the one afraid here. Not you that waste your life on daily basis on the ties of women. Listen to me. It's either you do it my way, or I'll walk. 
Okay. Don't worry, okay, wait, 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 wait. Don't be in a hurry, okay? Don't be in a hurry, baby. Okay, how much is my fee? I don't need your money. Like I said before, I want to enjoy the pleasure in sex. Hey, come on, girl, give it to me like it's hot. <laughs> oh. I wish I could die now. Damn. I guess it wasn't an easy attempt. I'm so tired. <sighs> I never believed that things could go so wrong to this degree in my life. So how did it go? I did it. I've lost it. I have lost my virginity. I laid with him without contraceptive. He offered me money, but I rejected it. I secretly took his card. In case there should be need to trace him. Jay, what a risk. That was an intelligent one, sister, but from the look of things, I don't think there will be any need for that. I hope you don't tell him your name. How could I? It was a risk worth taking. For you. For Mama. For us. Sister. You've really tried for us. Thank you so much. You are one in a million. I owe you a lot for this. Family owes you a lot. It's okay. I need to catch some sleep now. I didn't sleep last night. I am in trouble. Williams, you remember that girl I left with from the club last night? There's something strange about that girl. And it bothers me, Williams. But it bothers me. Huh? So tell me, what really happened? That girl is not a prostitute. I'm telling you, would you believe that when we got to the location, you know what I'm talking about? Would you believe that this girl told me to my face that all she needs from me is just the pleasure in sex that she does not want my money that is what this girl told me i mean yana what can you show i mean what sort of girl from a nightclub will reject money from a guy that was to take advantage of her brother? god bless you williams Oh God, Bali, thank you. You understand, my brother. You do understand. Eh? Do you know that 
that girl at first told me that she is a virgin. I thought she was joking. But when I entered, when I, I discovered that she was a virgin. Fresh virgin. Unbelievable. That is not all. Do you know that at first, the girl told me to browse without a passport. That I should enter the country without a passport. I should come in without a condom. When you were I looked at her from a distance. I suspected her move. But actually, because my ties were itching me, I had to. I entered. I entered her bed. Lo and behold, she was a virgin. Unbelievable. So, what's her name? Eh? That is true. She did not tell me her name. She did. You, you, the, the problem of the problem is that I hope I have not contacted. Man, honestly speaking, I don't see it that way. You say she's a virgin. So how possible? It's possible. It's very possible, girls of these days. You can never tell. Huh? Who knows what ambition is? Who knows? My own guy, oh boy, this thing they scatter my brain. Honestly speaking, this is serious. Well, I suggest you go for a test. <laughs> and if it proves negative, then huh? you know if you can find her. Man, such girls are hard to get, bro. Ha! You never can tell. You never, you can never try it again. No. Enter, enter without. Be careful. Guy, no matter how they sweet you reach, guy, no forget. Hey! You know they, they know they carry empty leg labor for ground, bro. Be yourself. I hope that they could have been changed. Nothing they have. That they could have been changed. What is happening? Mama, I feel weak and dizzy. A slight headache, just like yesterday. Mom, this your weakness and dizziness is becoming so suspicious. Are you not pregnant? I think so, ma'am. I think so. I think what you did is right. Yes. We must always remove the bone in the neck, otherwise it chokes us to death. We took appropriate action. Yes. Ah. Hmm. Jane, since I sent them away, I have not gotten myself back. Okusiade, you will overcome that. Okusiade. And this, this uh, new wife of a thing. Where do I even start from? Uh, uh, did you do what um, Ichetaka told you? No, in the first place, did you see him again? <sighs> uh, you know what Ichetaka said? Everything he told me depended on my wife going to meet him. But the woman refused. That shows you that that woman never wanted your happiness. Okay, no. Yes. And the answer to that is to look for a second wife. Go for a second wife. Even I call him. Do you do you have a woman in mind? Uh, that I advise you go for a second wife doesn't mean I have. My my opinion on this is that you go. Make your choice. After all in our town. You have different shapes of women, different sizes. Those who are tall and skinny, those who are big. They have this kind of a nyafu nyafu ike, you know. 
Go and make your choice. It's, 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 it's now in your court. Make your choice. You know, go. Oh? Make your choice. What's left of me to cry out is blood. What's left of me to pay out just what did the doctor say? The doctor said that I'm pregnant. Pregnant? Pregnant? How come, Mama? Did you and Papa? Yes. But you and Papa have not been at peace all this while. How did this happen? My daughter, this unity doesn't stop husband and wife from staying together. I met with your father some weeks before he sent us out of his house. As a child, I'm not supposed to tell you all this. But I'm just doing it to clear your mind. I don't know whether to be happy or sad. Who knows what Papa's reaction will be on getting to know about this. Mm. I am sure he might still believe it will be a baby girl. Mm. I don't have anything to say until I see my mother. Is she in the house? Yes, Mama. She's inside. So, my in law, I come here with your wife to tell you that she is pregnant for you. Man, I'm pregnant for you. <laughs> you know. This news does not excite me. It does not excite me at all. Because I know where it's going to end. This pregnancy is going to end up in another baby girl. In law, boy or girl, a child is a child. Take back your family. <laughs> Do you know that I have actually concluded arrangements on when and how to bring in a new wife? I suggest you cancel all that and take back your family. I can't bear the shame of being back in my parents' house. You told me. I want to stay in your house. No, please. Are you making it? Unu kuchagun. Unu kuchagun. Adema. You know I am a kind husband. I have always been a kind husband. Hmm. Um. Um. In law. I was actually going out. Um, there is a key to the house. Open the door, give Mama, even if it's a cup of water. Hmm? Hmm. Thank you, Mama. Uh, let me go and come. Thank you. Uh, don't even go there. Don't go so fast. I just want to say this right here now. If at the end of the day, this pregnancy turns out to be a baby girl, it is going to be the beginning of another round of trouble. That's just what I want to say here. Agabam, Mzuko. 
Hey, hello, sweetheart. Where are you headed? Why don't you hop in so I can drop you off? It's none of your business where I'm going to. Oh, come on, sweetheart. I don't bite. I'm not gonna harm you, okay? Let me drop you off. Okay? Thanks for the offer, but I'm fine. Sweet love, it's not fair having a pretty lady like you standing here all alone. Let me drop you off. Please. Okay, fine. <laughs> Mama, I see suggest we call Sister Chinelo and ask her to stop. You know, it has been out of three weeks since she left. And I believe that by this time she must have done it. And not only that, your father is still threatening, telling me that he will throw me out of the house if I do not give birth to a baby boy. And from the look of things, it seems that this one loves her turn to be a girl. You're right, Mama. And even since we came back here, Papa has not been treating us fine. Hmm. So you understand the situation. But sometimes, I seem to regret why I accepted that kind of idea. As a Christian, I'm not supposed to. Let's not go into that, Mama. Somadina's suggestion then seems to be the only way out. It's a risk worth taking, Mama, or the worst will follow. Nene, go to my room. Get my phone and call your sister. Tell her that we have returned back to our house. Please, don't tell them that I'm pregnant so that they will still go on with the plans. I can't be that stupid. You know, it is some that you call. Mm -hmm. Not Chinelo. Chinelo changed her phone number because of her name. Mm -hmm. And she will still send us her new number. Later on. I'm aware of that, Mama. Okay. Let me make a phone call. Okay. Nai, you called me. Oh. Mm. Leveji. You have been home now for a fairly long time. In all this time, I'm yet to see Chinelo. Somadina, I understand. That one is understandable, she's in school. Where is Chinelo, my first daughter? Nai, I told you that Chinelo traveled with Somadina to the city. After you sent us packing from the house. And I have asked her to come back that you have accepted us. She says she will not. Until she finds out that you will not send us packing again. I see. I see. If that is what she said. It is better she remains there. It is better she doesn't come back to this household. Because even in your own case, I'm not sure whether you're staying or not. The sex of this uh, baby, whether this baby is a boy or a girl, will determine whether you are staying or not. I am. No. Why are you speaking in this manner? Let me change. I am speaking in this manner because I speak in this manner. 
I am speaking in this manner because I want you to hear me very well. I am speaking in this manner because I do not want to be misunderstood. Ekujalam, abo mili nona. There is no water in my mouth. Yeah, welcome, sister. Oh, how did it go? It went as planned. The doctor confirmed it. I'm pregnant. Wow. The news is good. Let me call Mama. No, 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 don't. Not yet. Mm. I have my reasons. Akajindu <sighs> called earlier this morning. She said that Anne's wedding is today. I don't blame the young man. He has tried. Suddenly, I left him with no reason. I changed my phone number. I called you several times, but you rejected his calls. And you earlier told me that the parents were on his neck to see him get married, being the first son of a titled man. He really has tried. I'm taking much drinks here. Yes. Leben one. I said I should come to see how things have been since you came back with Yaka. Mama, honestly. Things have not been easy for me. These days, my husband treats me like a slave. <laughs> God help me if this child is not delivered, the boy. <laughs> All shall be well. I believe that God we serve cannot let us down. Amen. Where is Yaka? Mama, she has gone to school. I'm glad she has resumed school. What of Chinelo and Somadina? Mama, they are fine. They do call. Sometimes I call them. There is no problem, nothing to worry about. Ah, when will they come back? Hmm. Mama, they will soon come back. There is nothing to worry about. Okay, where is your husband? My husband left early this morning without even telling me where he was going. Oh, has he gone to this level? Let us have faith and hope. I know God will serve. He will do us better. Amen. What is the problem? Eh? It's your mambo. Uh, I am worried. I am worried. My wife is still in labor. Your wife in labor? Since yesterday. Ah, but you me, Kensi Nani. The case I just came home to pick one or one or two things. My, my, my daughter Haka is still in hospital with her. Hi. Oh, lawyer, you see why I suggested you, you go for a second wife? Sort of passing through all this. Eh? In a few days' time, you will be crowned or no one. Eh? Mm. No male child? Eh? eh? Are you understanding that? You see, you see the, the, the point is right now, uh, that is not important. Eh? What I want now, what I'm praying God for now is that my wife delivers safely. If she puts to bed and it's, it's a female child, then now we have to ask the Igwe or the Ono for an extension. Ono, oh, how can you say that? You are forgetting the, the numerous benefits that will go with this your position. What of the official car from the government? What of the encomiums? Benefits from all corners. Why are you thinking like, go for yourself? Well, we'll give you male son. 
So that time, you can stand a good work. I don't know. Why do you want to you still wait until six months time? Eh? Hey. No, 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 no. No. Make mm. hay while sun shines. Make the temptation hay. is too much to. Papa, 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 Mama has finally given birth a long awaited bouncing baby boy. Yes. Okay. Hey. Yes, sir. My Mama. daughter. Yes. A bouncing baby boy. Baby boy. Oh, she came out. Oh, oh. Mama. Oh. Thank you. Thank Hey baby, I've been waiting for your stay. What's wrong with my baby? Hmm? You're a super. You're a super. Mila, it's been over a year now since you and I got married, right? Mm-hmm. And there's not been a cry of a baby in this house. Doesn't that bother you? Baby, you know I'm a woman. And it bothers me more than it bothers you. But the doctor said we are fine medically, so we shouldn't worry ourselves. And remember, God's time is the best. Hmm? Come on, baby. I am worried. And so are my parents. Okay, you know what? Come, let's go upstairs. We'll talk about it later. Okay? Please smile for me. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come, let's go freshen up. You know we're supposed to go out. Give me your hands. Come on. Oh. Yeah, that's my baby. Hey, Mama. You're welcome. Yeah, I have a son. Where is Papa? Hey! Hey! I call Who's him Ebube. Ebube. Yes. This is a very handsome boy. I also have a son. Uh, uh, His name is Tito. What? Mama? How did it happen? You couldn't even call us all this way. It's a long story. Oh. <laughs> ah. Ah. See who we have here. See hello. So my dinner. <laughs> hey. Papa, I have a son for you. The son he have always desired to get to a traditional prime minister title. His name is Ebupe. Well, I have already been honored. Huh? In fact, I was um, honored a few days ago with the traditional prime minister title. And I have a son. I have a son. Oh. 
Um, where have you been all this long while, by the way? And that child, where is, where is it coming from? My, please. Allow them to go in. Please, in my. We know they are just coming back. Papa. <laughs> I do not have to say once again. Now, listen to me. You people don't even seem to understand what is happening here. Eh? This one is crying, this one is crying. You don't look. I have been honored as the Prime Minister of this community. It is a big title. And this title cannot broker, cannot allow any disgrace. I mean, how can I, as a, with this title, I... an illegitimate child. No. Chinelo. Chinelo. If that child you're carrying is an illegitimate child, then I give you till tomorrow morning to leave this house. Papa. Yeah. Leave me alone. Let me talk. Chinelo. I don't want to see you in my house after tomorrow morning. First thing tomorrow morning, you are leaving this house. And that is final. Final, final, final. wrong have I done to you, Mama? Can you fall down, Melge? You couldn't call to inform us that you were pregnant. Even when you gave birth, Mama, you couldn't still call to inform us. What sort of wickedness was that, Mama? My daughter, don't talk to your mother like that. I discovered that I was pregnant. Just few days. There's somebody that called and told me that I've taken it by, a, by an unknown person. So I decided not to tell you about it. Even you, Akajin. Even you, my trusted sister. You couldn't even go. Don't blame your sister. I decided not to tell you people. So that you will still concentrate on whatever that you are doing and go on with our plans. And more especially, I was afraid that I, 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 I might end up in giving birth to a baby girl. And I so much believe that one out of the babies will be a baby boy. Precisely yours, Chinelo. That was why I decided not to bother your life with my problems. Now that Papa is behaving this way, what are we going to do? 
Te te pasé todo eso. Coge vantaje de truth. Who knows? Whether he will have a change of mind. And have pity on Chinelo. Not in this situation, Mama. I know Papa very well. He will not show pity at all. If he gets to know that we all are involved in this, he will hate us all. Especially you, Mama. I think Kaka has a point there. The only option left is that I go back to the city with Sister Chinelo. There we'll start a new life. Papa is wicked. Chinelo, my sister. I thought you have come to stay. I never knew you would live again. I will miss you so much, sister. Don't worry, Aka. I'll be visiting home to see you and Mama. Mama, please take care of Aka and don't you to my boy. I will. I will. Sister, now that we are back to the city, I want you to pull yourself together. All hope is not lost. We believe that soon we shall cry no more. See what Papa has put me into. My own father. Who on earth would believe that a father could treat his own child like this? I curse the day I called him Papa. Please, don't check the baby. Please. Okay. Sister, this is the place. I'm afraid. Are you sure you will not? You will not let yes, through. Sister, let's have a drive first. Just go in with the boy while I wait for you. Now. Uh -huh. But you said you can't bear to see me fly. This is not what was signed up for. But please, I will to go there Freedom. I miss home. Good day, sir. Please, uh, can I see your organ? My organ? He's busy inside. Please, sir, it's very important. Please, let me in. Please, I beg in the name of God. I say. He is busy inside, and you know they're in the mood to see anybody, and you're still here talking. I beg, get out. <laughs> Girl, I said something. Don't worry for herself. Are you are you crazy? Wait, what's that for? What? The thing in your hand. It's a condom for crying out loud and I believe you know what it is used for. Huh? Come on, Levy. I don't need it. Yes. I told you before that I want to enjoy the pleasure in sex. Listen. I've never had sex in my life before. And now that I've decided to do it, I want to enjoy myself. I want to enjoy it. Please, I don't need that. You want me to go 
to your Burundi without a passport. I mean, you want me to do it wrong? You want me to do it bad? Yes. Without? Hey, I should be the one afraid here. Not you that waste your life on daily basis on the ties of women. Listen to me. It's either you do it my way or I'll walk. Okay. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Don't be in a hurry, okay? Don't be in a hurry, baby. Okay, how much is my fee? I don't need your money. Like I said before, I want to enjoy the pleasure and sex. Hey, come on, girl, give it to me like it's hot. <laughs> oh. yeah. I wish I could die now. Damn. You seem to have remembered me. What are you doing here? You see, on that night, I got pregnant. This baby here is your son. <laughs> you are a joker. You hear me? You are a joker. You have been pregnant for me all these months and you never bothered to come look for me? There was no how I could reach you. I didn't have your office address or phone number or even home address. Well, that reminds me. How did you locate me? It's a long story. Moreover, that's not why I'm here. Please, what do you say about your son? His name is Ibube. I mean, what do you say about us? You're stupid. You are very stupid! You see, on that very night, I discovered that you're totally a strange woman. I won't let you have your way this time. I will advise you to leave else. I'll shoot you. Please, I beg you. Please. Please. Please, I'm begging you. Please. I beg in the name of God. Don't do this to me. I don't have where else to go. This is your son. Your well, son. I have been married for over a year now. Leave before my wife comes here and meet you. It's your son. Please. Asa, will you take your leave? Please, it's your son. Please, please. Please. You I said, get, get, the, get lost. Your Get That's lost! So, my son, you have heard it all. I had waited for this day. The day you will walk up to me and insist to know who your father is. <sighs> this is a very long story, Mom. And a shocking one, too. I must say that you were courageous and kind enough. Oh, yes. Thank you, my son. Thank you. You're welcome, Mom. It was a terrible experience. I seem to be the only one losing now. Akajindu is happily married to an American-based businessman. And Samadna, too. She's happily married with kids. 
Yeah, I am. It's okay. At least you still have me. And secondly, and the summer has she has been good to us. Oh yes. Yes. She has been good. And I catch him the two. All the cars. Even this apartment. She sent all. She has been good. But he told your only brother has never visited us in the city. Why is that so wrong? My son, it's not Otito's fault. Mm -mm. It's not his fault. It's my father, again. Your father again? Mother, your father. My grandfather Ichi Oloyo is evil. And I shall make him pay for his evils. Tell me more about your grandma. Hmm. Grandma. Hmm. She died three years after Mama gave birth to Tito. I attended her burial. With you. There, I met my father. But he didn't say a word to me. After the burial, I came back to the city without visiting my father's compound. And is um, your fatherland? My son. The last time I set my foot on exam was the day I presented it to my father. But he threw us out. Mother, what of an Yes, what of an hmm. He should be much older now. With many kids. One more thing, Mom. The whole idea of either you or Auntie Som are getting pregnant all came from Auntie Som. How come you later became the one that took up the challenge? My son. It happened in Grandma's place. Mama, your children have decided how to fold their arms and what things go wrong before us. I've come up with a very good idea. What Papa wants is a male child in our family. In addition, the ruler of the title is six states that the chair in question should have a male child born in that same family. Not necessary from the man himself. You are right, my child. You are right. Yes, you are right. What Papa wants is a male child in our family. Besides, the man I'm going to meet will be someone that I never knew. Who will never know that I'm pregnant for him. And at such, he will never come for the baby. My child, we are Christians. We are not supposed to do such a thing. Mama, do you prefer to protect your Christian belief and live like slave here? Which man will come to marry us in our grandmother's house? Two people should see reasons with me, oh. Sisters. I will do it. I'm ready to take the risk and save my family. No, sister. You've done enough. Damn in school today is because you accepted to step down for me to be trained. I believe it's my turn now. Stop it. We sent you to school so that you can graduate and marry a wealthy man. 
so that you can help in training others. If you do this, the money we spent on sending you to school will be a waste. So, I will do it. I'm the first daughter of this family. What happens to Anele? Mama, Anele can find himself another woman. The interest of this family is paramount. But Sister Chinelo, I... Stop it, Aka. End of discussion. If we are together in this, let's join our hands. It's okay, Mom. I think I've I've had enough. <laughs> mom, it's okay. What are you crying? You're crying, Mom. It's okay. Please don't cry. It's okay. Okay? Don't cry. Okay. You know what will happen? Let me go upstairs and think. All right. Son. Son, you can't. You can't see your sister. Eh? That her son is a bastard. Son, you need to understand. Allow this boy to go to the city and see his sisters. Why are you so wicked? Why? Ekuchalam. 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 Shut up. You are Shoribi. Shoribi. I'm a Korea. Listen. This boy. This boy has only two sisters. Somadina and Akajindo. I must. I repeat. I must see my elder sister, Chingelo, and her son, Ebu. You know what? There is nothing you can do about it. You might have stopped me when I was younger, but not anymore. I am a man now. I am a man, Father. If you do that, I will disown you. Oh. <laughs> disown today. Disown tomorrow. Disown next tomorrow. Father, you've said this. You, you, you've said this repeatedly. Disown me. Father, disown me. Disown him. I said disown him. What are you waiting for? You have forgotten the time you were looking for a boy. Disown him. I want you to do it now, now, now. Don't even waste time. Nonsense.
Uh, why is your face like this? What is the problem? Oh. How many times did you take me to my father to explain things to him when I was a kid? Is that why your face is like this? Hmm? Is that why you look this sad? Anyway, I revisited several times after I went with Samadna. He didn't listen to me. I stopped and decided to bear the burden alone. Please tell me, do you still have my father's card? The one you stole from his wallet that night? Mm. Yes, I do. Okay, that's good. Please. Can you help me with the card? I need to find my father. No. I will advise you forget about your father. Forget him. Be cool. Eh? You know he's married. And you should have many kids now. Moreover, he must have changed his house address, office address, or even phone number. 20 years is a long time, you know. Hold on, eh? please, just give me the card. Give me the card. You know what to do with it, okay? Please. Have his house address on it. Please. Please. Okay, Thank you. Follow me. No. to be. What have I done wrong? Why would you give Pamela to me as a wife? Why? Why? You seem to have remembered me. What are you doing here? You see, on that night, I got pregnant. This baby here is your son. <laughs> you are a joker. You hear me? You are a joker. You have been pregnant for me all these months and you never bothered to come look for me? There was no how I could reach you. I didn't have your office address or phone number or even home address. Well, that reminds me. How did you locate me? It's a long story. Moreover, that's not why I'm here. Please, what do you say about your son? His name is Ibube. I mean, what do you say about us? I, I have a son. God, I have a son. I have a son. 
So happy today. Tell me, what is the secret? My son, I'm indeed very happy today. Don't worry. In a few minutes, hmm? something will happen. Don't worry. Wow. Well, I can't wait. Yeah, Let's keep waiting. for one Chinelo Oloi. I don't know if I'm in the right compound. Mm. My dear, you're in the right place. You must be Otito Oluye. Am I right? Sister Chinelo! <laughs> come on, come on! Sister! Excuse me, excuse me, please. Who is holding my mom this close? Mother! Who is she? Father's issue. Surely I'll find him. I must find Mr. Six Two Son Uzulike. And when I do, <laughs> I'll kill him slowly. Hmm? He doesn't deserve to leave. Does he? Considering all that I hear. Are you with me in this fight, Ozito? I am strongly with you, brother. Thank you. Thank you. Now that you know where he lives, will you be able to recognize him when you see him? Oh, yes. Yeah. I have this picture in my phone and it is clear enough. On that same night, he made love to my mom. She has secretly taken him a snapshot at the hotel room before she left. My father was weak and asleep when she did that. Christ. A lot really happened on that same night. And now, I have his picture here. In that case, Otito, I will get the weapons ready myself. Why, your brother? 
or love? Um, my daughter. Now, my P, you are visiting. Hmm? Uh, Otito, my son, has been missing for two days now. But I suspect he traveled to the city to see Gennaro. Against my advice. Nay, how could you say such a thing? You and I know that Otito cannot travel that far without telling any of us. What is all this? Don't worry, Father. I will check on him in Sister Chinelo's house on my way back. Thank you, my dear. Um, when you get there, please tell Otito, my son, that he must hurry back to the village immediately. Eh? Oh, where is my... Hey! Um, let me, I'm coming, let me get my son. Please, nobody should touch this. It is sacred. I'm coming. Hey, you're welcome. Thank you very much for sending Otito to come and see me. Seeing him was the best, I mean, the happiest day of my life. Thank you very much. Ah, uh, well, the happiest day of your life is here to go. I'll be back. Okay, I'm waiting. I am very sorry. Very, very sorry. I know I have wronged you deeply. But deep down inside my soul, I am dying. I have realized my mistakes. I have come to ask you for forgiveness. And to take me back. Please. Sisters, how did you look at me? <sighs> well, um, see, after the incident, before you left that morning, I saw you taking snapshots of me. You thought I was asleep, but I pretended to be asleep because I knew there was something strange about you. And so, I asked, I asked someone to go after you, to trail you. And he came back with good results. As you can see, this is a new apartment. 
I ask you again, how did you look at me? Well, today I, I decided to try my luck. And because God was on my side, I went to you for my lunch. While I was in the process of asking questions, lo and behold, there was your sister. Yes, sister. It was at the lodge to see our old friend, who I heard is seriously sick. Then I met sisters here. Coincidentally, he was looking for you. Looking for me for what? I don't get it. Can somebody explain this to me? I'm losing it. Sweetie. To tell you how sorry he is and for you to accept him back as your husband. Sweetie. My daughter, so your man has refused to accept the paternity of the child? Yes, Mama. And I've stopped trying. I've learned to live with it. That's okay, my daughter. Remember, any time, any day, Ebube's father comes for you and Ebube. Please, accept him and forgive him. That's the only way you can restore your dignity and your father put to shame. I'm very sorry. I'm very sorry. He has realized his mistakes. Forgive him, please. I promise I would never let you go again. Please. Sister, please forgive him for my sake. Mom, my good day. Mom, what's this man doing here? I am sorry, son. I am sorry. Please forgive me. The hand of God is in this because you would have been a dead man some minutes ago. I'm forgiving you, Dad. If I don't find him, pray to him that I find him or oh, 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 what? Listen to me, old man. God are the days you were treating me like nobody. Let me tell you, you cannot do anything to me at all. You cannot even touch me. <laughs> you can't do anything. No sense. <laughs> see, see this one, no. When did this one start? The nemesis will soon catch up with you. Look at this one. It's me. You? Yes. Sam, let me see you. Oh, my God. Finish. Look at me. Is that all? Are you not seeing me? A yes. woman. 
a woman a woman that says like this to, 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 to peace anytime you want to peace you must stay like this do you know who you are talking to by the way what's wrong with you for God's sake I mean what's wrong with you what is happening here what, are, what do we have here eh? when a man talks you should listen to the man I am a man one two I'm your husband three I am the traditional prime minister of Zam Kingdom. TPM, that's who I am. So you listen to me. Okay? That will get back to your own Go to hell with that, your useless title. Nonsense. Now. Yes, thank you. Hey, my love. Thank you very much. Welcome. Thank you. Look at you. <laughs> <laughs> so, Madina, where did you where where did you find him? Father, I hate you. Yeah. So, this cannot be coming from you, huh? So, Madina, you are evil, Father. What is happening? Huh? Do you know one? You're here now. Papa? Uh, it's me and my son. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. It's again. Ebube. Ebube is like this. Ebube has grown like this. Ebube, my own son. <laughs> You have grown like this, as big as this. So, who is the Ugona Tomma? Eh? That is with you. Hey, Papa. He's my handsome husband. <laughs> His name is Sixtus. Oh, yeah. Honestly. That's right. Don't say. My own son in law. This one is my son in law. My son in law. Hey! Mwam. Ah. Ah. See my son. See my son in law. You're welcome. Thank you. So, how are you, my dear? I am fine, sir. Thank you very much. Good. You see, Papa? Yes, my dear. I'm very happy today. Oh, very. Look, eh? Don't say it. Do you know, if you enter inside my heart, it is white as snow. Happy. I'm even happier because you are alive and healthy. You lived to see my husband. I am here, alive. The father of my son. That's Ibube. right. That's right. Mm? Uh -huh. Nobody can call my son a bastard now. Nobody will do that. Tinelo, nobody will do that. Anybody that does that, I am going to curse that person. This is my, 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 my big son. My own son. Papa. Yes. You are very wicked. Obita, give me the after job, your papa. You are wicked. In fact, you are evil. I curse the day I open this my mouth to call you father. Hey! Mom, 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 mom. Mom, let this not come from your mouth now, please. Please, oh. Please, oh. See, hello, mom. Hey. See, hello. Look at your father. My sons. Hey. Come on. Hi. Sasha. Hey. My wife. Uh -uh. No. Uh -uh. Don't even go there. Please. For peace to reign. Don't call me your wife again. 
Because I am not married to any man. I am single. Yes. Grandpa. I don't have a husband. Grandpa. I would have loved to kill you myself. But I will now allow the hand of fate to play in strong car. There is nothing I would like better than to see your corpse on the ground. Hey, Bupe. This is your father. You cannot say that now. You cannot. And Papa, huh? I called Akajindo on our way here. She said that I should inform you right. that she does not wish to see you alive on the next return from America with her husband and kids. Hey. This is happening to only one man. Oh. Uh -huh. All this, all this is happening to one man, oh. One man cannot bear this alone, oh. Tineke, God, oh. God, you are alive, oh. Have mercy on me, oh. Oh, mama, have mercy on me now, please. Please. Without you, who am I? I'm nobody, oh. My in-law. In-law. In-law, say something, oh. In-law, say something before something happens here, oh, please. Before somebody dies. Uh, well, um, I, as I can see, it is a family matter. And I, I wouldn't want to indulge myself in this. No. No. In law, say something better. Listen to me, Grandpa. The measure you give, the measure you shall receive. I'm being a little Get down! This is serious, Mr. Sixtus. Do you have anyone in mind as a primary suspect? Um, not for now. Um, DPO, but I'll update you as soon as I come close to any helpful information. That would be nice. Um, I am glad that you reported the case to the police at that area. Uh, take it from me. We shall unravel the mysterious disappearance of your son. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much, sir. We are both welcome. Yes, how can I help you people? My name is Inspector Sally. 
Then the Sergeant Clifford and Sergeant Bright. Summer dinner. Yes, please find a seat for them. Oh no, madam. We don't need a seat. We have police officers. We stand on it. Welcome. Madam, you were in a station to make a report over the mysterious kidnap of your grandson. I am the officer you trusted today to investigate the case. Here are my men with me. Uh, madam, we're actually here to help you. But um, we will equally be needing your help through information where necessary. We want to help you, okay? I understand. Pardon my manners. Madam, tell me. Do you have any suspect in mind? For now, I can't really point a finger at anyone. Yes, officer. We need some time to enable lost things. That will be okay for now. Remember to keep us updates when there is any. Okay, I will. Thank you very much. Shall we on our way now? Right. All right. I suspect Papa is a very wicked man. When I called Akajindu to tell her about this, she also said that we should watch Papa closely. She said that Papa is her first suspect. You mean Aka, my daughter, said so? Yes, Mama. I suspect him too. But we need to be careful. This is a very sensitive issue. We will go to the city and see your elder sister. I was going to your house. I'm uh, okay, I met you here. Yes. I what see. is happening? What is happening? Hmm. Eh? It's your own name. My house is on fire. My wife, my children. They hate me. They now hate me so much that they call me evil man. I have pleaded with them to no avail. I don't know what to do again. I say pity that's what you're going through. But that's not what brought me to your house that I met you here now. <clears throat> hey. I heard that your grandson who was brought to your house was kidnapped the same day. So I so said, let me ask you, did you have a hand in that kidnap? That's what does what, what, what does this mean? The news is in the air. What does this mean, Ichie? Don't misunderstand eh? me, my friend. Don't. Ichie, Oloye. Even when he keeps his own. Eh? Ah, but you are making sense now, eh? But you say me and Bobo. Ah, but you are not making sense now, eh? But you say me, Bobo, Bobo, Bobo. Shut up, sir. Please. How far have you people gone with the investigation? Sir, we have not recorded much progress for now. Sergeant Charles and I are drawing out a better plan on how to tackle the problem. Mm, that's okay. okay. You guys have to be very fast in whatever plan you are drawing. It's okay, sir. I can assure you, sir. Our hands are on deck. Get on with it then. Sure, yes, sir. sir. <laughs> So, 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 Madi. Where are you going with your mother this early morning? And what is your business with where we are going to? So, <laughs> Madi, my daughter, you didn't have time to answer his questions. Nonsense. Oh, no, 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 no,
Huh? My darling, my darling uh, 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 wife. Huh? Please, I have pleaded with you. I have pleaded with you repeatedly. Huh? Have mercy now. Huh? Forgive, forgive me. We are Christians, so. We are Christians, so. You are a Christian, no? Please. Even Christ Himself. Christ for, forgive, forgive, forgive sinners. Pastor. Yes. I like this preaching. Preach! Forgive me. Pastor! Pastor, preach! Continue preaching. Nne, if you are new, name Messi. I know. Nna, I don't know. Hey, Messi. Messi. I will share that, man. <laughs> Did you say we should forgive you, Father? You haven't seen anything yet. Awesome. By the time we come back, and then you will see the one who is in your beard. Mm. Hey, my son. Yeah, my mom. As I told you last night. Yeah. You spend. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Hmm? I just go away, Mama. Thank okay. You, thank you. That's <laughs> also. Let's go, my daughter. Okay. No. Come on, give me a hug. Okay. <laughs> mm. <laughs> don't worry, I'll get you something on my brother. Okay. Sure, you know I have enough money. Oh, don't, don't worry, don't worry, don't bother about me. You know what? My friends now call me a big one. I'm now a big boy. What? Yes, boy. my son is a big, big boy. boy. Let's go. Let's, Let's go. go. <laughs> You are my son. Don't join these women. Don't join them in treating your father this way. Eh? Son. Don't touch me. By the way, who did you even refer to as a son? Me? Where do you want to go? Good morning, my good morning, my daughter. How are you? Fine, fine. Tell your mother that that our meeting has been cheated to make. Okay, I'll tell her. Okay. Hello. 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 That the true Ono was the one that kidnapped her grandson. My sister, that's what I heard. So, hmm. well, what are they planning to do about it now? My dear, I don't know. But the whole family is now against the true Ono. That man is very wicked. You need to see how he maltreated Chinelli. Anyway, that's their own cup of Gary. I beg, make you walk up past here before people go talk to you to gossip. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know why all these things are happening to me, Mama. What have I done wrong? Where did I go wrong? Huh? Hi, Chinanke. 
Especially now that my husband and I are planning to bring out a date for our wedding. Did you say wedding? I thought your husband was married before he... They never wedded. My husband was waiting for her to get pregnant for him. But she already lost her womb. Hey! Children of nowadays, how can a girl live with a man for almost 20 years without a white wedding? It's common these days, Mama. Chinelo, yeah. my sister, you have to stop crying. Maybe we will be rescued. When? How? How fast? Hey, I miss my boy so much. I miss him so much. Hey, Bube, where are you? Where are you? <sighs> Sister, Papa has a hand in this. Yes. Remember that he has never been happy with you and Ebube. Yes. You have a point. You have a point. What do we do? We have to arrest him. The police will have to torture him until he reveals the truth. But we have no evidence linking him to the kidnap case. He is the chief suspect. We will tell the police that he has a hand in this. But don't allow your husband to know about this. So please. Yes. I'm scared, father. Heartless father. Heartless father. Okay. No problem. I'll not allow my husband to hear about it. Thank God he's not at home. So, Mama, how do we go about it? Mr. Cruz, where is the boy? Let's say in the room down there. Say I go buy Ferrari if you come to. Please, madam. It was my offense. Please tell me what I've done wrong. Now, quickly, me that is for you, please. So, you are not here to find more at all? <laughs> yes, indeed. This is what you want, ma'am. Idiot. I'm sorry. I can't help your situation. Madam, please. Please spare my life. <laughs> no way. You must die. It's not me that is going to kill you, but your father. My father? Yeah. What do you mean? You, you mean my father has a hand in all this? Oh, not too much. It's all right. You'll get to know when the time is right. <laughs> oh, yes, I forget. I know you're a sinner. Hmm? And I know you must have done one or two things with different women. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yeah. It is written all over his body. Motherfucker. Oh, I want you to kneel and... Oh, you're, you're kneeling already. <laughs> I want you to ask God for forgiveness. Mm? Sure. Ask him to have mercy on you so you won't get disappointed on his judgment throne. <laughs> Duella, please take me out of this place. Motherfucker! <laughs> 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 oh, God. 
guys are really doing a nice job here. <laughs> Thank you. Hmm. Oh. Boy, you be? Yes. What are we waiting for? Why can't we kill the boy before something goes wrong? No. <laughs> no, Chantal. I've changed my mind. I can't kill him without getting his father. Oh. I want us to capture his father. He will be the one to shoot him. Hmm? And I will shoot him after he must have shot his son. <laughs> hmm. Mr. Sistus, you must pay for your sins. But if I may ask, what actually happened, Lady V? Miss Chantel, it is none of your business. Oh! oh. I had <laughs> Things are really getting out of hand. I can't continue to fold my arms and watch things go wrong. It's obvious Pamela has a hand in all this. Six to use me and talking. But wait, six to is there. It's his own family, happy home, and I'm here. Loneliness won't kill me. No, it's not possible. Oh, no. I cannot let him have his freedom. I cannot. He's not going to go unpunished. Who does she even think she is? Hmm? I was an XYZ Capone of the Black Scorpions back then in my university days. And now, the woman thinks she can urinate on top of me. My original person must surface now. Who is, who, who, who the hell is Sixtus to point a finger at me? Pamela Ofodi, the ex Capone of the deadly white angels. Who the hell is he? <laughs> no, I have to do something about it. It's not gonna go scoffing. Yes, she must pay for it. Son, I'm talking to you. I'm talking to you here, son. Listen to me. Leave me alone, father. I don't want to talk to you. No, 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 no. No, son. No, son. Son, don't do that. Son, don't do that. Listen to your father, son. Do not be deceived, son. I'm not here to deceive you. I don't allow anybody to deceive you. Father, son. nobody's deceiving me. You treated my sister Chinelo like a slave. Like a slave, father. <sighs> that was wickedness. No. You don't understand. Your sister Kajindo is married in the way in America. Are you going to allow her to control, to dictate from America what is going to happen in your own house? Son, this is your own house. That is what I am telling you. Reason it out. Son, you are the only lawyer. There are only two lawyers left in this whole wide world. Son. You are the only Oloye, the only person that will bear the Oloye family name. 
Only you will sign when I'm not there. You are all that is about to know you, no other person, son. Okay, okay, okay. So, what do you want me to do? Good. Good. Son, I'm going to sit. I'm going to sit. And we will both reason it out. Son, sit. That is good. See, son. What I'm saying is this. Young man, here is your food. Please. <laughs> Can you talk to me? Mm. Well, I'll consider you because you're a fine man. You may ask your question. Please tell me. What am I actually doing here? What was my offense? What's wrong have I done to you people? Because you have reasonable thing to say. You better eat this food and get stronger because there's no food in hell. <laughs> You mean I'm still going to die? In few days time, you can waste. Chai! Chai! Eat your food! Shut up, father. Sir, you are under arrest for the kidnap of one Mr. Ibube. You have your right to remain silent. No. Not in my life, Mr. Chinelo. You are useless! Samadina, let's go. He can stay behind with his words. Useless people. Idiot. My sisters have arrested my father. Your sisters arrested your father. Yes, and it's here. Why? It's here, I don't know. I don't know. Hey! Don't know. Eh? Eh? Just go. I'll go and see elders. Okay. You know what? It's here. Please help me. Who my boy? Hey! Ah, but you me can see Hey! It would not be good for this girl. Never! That's the woman. Hello, young lady. Yes. I guess you are Pamela of Odi. Yes, of course I am. Can I help you? Very good. Very good. You are police officers. I have a warrant to arrest you over a kidnap of one Mr. Ebube. You have the right to remain silent for anything you say here or do will be used against you in the court of law. Bam! Hold on. 
You came to arrest me. Six twos. Six twos. Are you behind this? Promised you I'll come for you. I told you I will come for you. Here I am. So you're behind this? You're under arrest. I can't explain. Shut down! Come on! Pick your hand! Move it! Move it! Criminal. Please. They just arrested that young lady. And I know it has everything to do with that kidnapping. He tells you I should be listening. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So let's Cruz, go. let's go. We'll get him on a very That was how it happened. But you turned around to me and informed me that the Ichiro lawyer's daughters got him arrested. Eh? This is unbelievable. This is terrible. How could they have arrested the Ichiro lawyer? The traditional prime minister of Isabuzuma. And then, elders, what do we do? That's why we're gathered here. The king delegated the three of us to take a look at this case. I am suggesting that we go to the police station, see a lawyer, and then see what the officers in charge can do for us in terms of bailing him. Eh? I'm afraid it may not be that easy to bail him, considering the nature of the case. I disagree. I disagree. Just imagine. Our people say you do not conclude by a male look at a con. That it is unripe. You tear it open for examination. Let's first of all go to the station. There we are supposed to know all that we need to know. Please, you have a point there. He has a point. Let's go first of all to the police station then see what can happen. How they can help us. But are we sure each lawyer does not have a hand in the kidnap? Judging by the way the whole thing happened. You're asking me, did I investigate? This is not what we are going to discuss right now, Mazazendo. Well, I said I should ask so. Oh, Adora! Next! Adora! Are you here? I'm here, oh my, my sister, god. My sister, have you heard? Heard what? You are not right hearing this one or the other. You saw it again. You saw it again. Oh no, who has been arrested for the kidnap of his own grandson? Jesus! Neka, you mean his own daughters arrested him for kidnapping? Yes, my dear, they did do. They accused him of kidnapping a Bibetinio son. Wonder shall never end. But, Neka, where did you even get this your gist from, if I may ask? Ha! I am Neka. Nene, I do go from house to house, sort of latest gist in town. You don't know me again. You don't know me again. I don't blame you. No, because Neka. Oh my god. Oh no. Sweetheart. You're not asleep. How can I be sleeping when my son is nowhere to be found? Who knows if he's still alive? No, oh, don't go there. I know my son is alive wherever he may be. Have you told your parents about this? Well, not yet. Sweetheart, I don't understand why you are keeping this whole thing away from your parents. Don't you think that the earlier they know, the better for... Yeah, no, but you know, I told you that my parents are in Germany. Yes, and um, you know how my mother behaves. If I get to tell her, she won't be relaxed down there any longer. I prefer to handle things my own way. Are you sure about this? I'm very sure.
Are you ready to tell us the truth now? Sir, I'm innocent. You more than the wrong person, sir. Are you kidnapped? I'm innocent, sir. By the time I am through with you, you will know why they call me Inspector. Inspector Larry, have you been able to find out any tangible information from the girl? Not at all, sir. She has been claiming innocence so far. Sir, I think she's innocent. 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 Still keep an eye on her. Sure, sir. Good day, sir. Good day. You are both welcome. Sit down. Thank you. Deep you. We are here to know how far you and your men have gone with the investigation. Sir, I no longer sleep at night. I understand how you feel, madam. We are doing our best here. Even the suspect we arrested at the instance of your husband is still claiming innocence all this while. Dipio, did you say at the instance of her husband? Yes. One Pamela, his ex-wife, he said that uh, she is his primary suspect. It's okay, sir. Sir, please. I beg you in the name of God, do everything you can, everything possible to find my boy. Please, I'm losing it. Please. I will do my best. I'm just coming from the police station. The DPO informed me that you arrested Pamela. Why didn't you tell me about it? Well, uh, you see, Otito called me some minutes ago, telling me that you arrested your father. Did you tell me about it? He called you. Oh, yes. You see, sweetheart, what we are doing now is just suspecting people. We are not 100% sure who is behind all this. Do you think that Pamela has a hand in this? She's my prime suspect. I am not 100% sure. But you have to release your father immediately. Despite all odds, he is still your father. Have you thought about what people will say? I don't care what people have to say. I don't care. My major concern is to find my son. Well, sweetie, I insist you release your father immediately. Please. I wish not to have this conversation any further. Let me go inside and get lunch ready. Okay. Yeah. 
Sir, I am only respecting you and your position as the traditional prime minister of the Zamzuma community. That is the reason why I don't want to use force on you. But it's like you still don't want to tell me the truth. Sir. Inspector, I have spoken the truth. Inspector, I have told you the truth. Inspector, please. I don't have any other thing I'm keeping back. I've said everything. Believe me. I, I, I don't, don't have any, any reason to lie. Please. Please. Okay. Please. I, how, how do you expect me? How do you expect me to kidnap my own grandson? How? Oh, there are no possible. Okay. Huh? What the fact who got us so far? We declare to us that you never like your grandchild and his mother. As a matter of fact, you threw them out of your house for many years. You do not even care to know their whereabouts. Hey. Hey. Officer. That was in the past. Please. That was in the past. I... I have an integrity. I'm a man of integrity. I have something I'm trying to protect. As the traditional prime minister, Officer, my daughter is not supposed to give birth, to put to bed out of wedlock. That was what I was trying to protect. Please. Not a wicked man. Is that reason cogent enough? For you to have had them thrown out of your house for many years. He did not even care to know their whereabouts. Anyway. Ije, I am giving you some time to make up your mind and tell me the truth. But if you did not, if you did not, I'll be left with no option than to use force on you. Hey, man. Officer, man. Sergeant. So? Take him back to the cell. Hey. hey. Yeah. Move, move, move. Let's go. Yeah. Move, move. Okay, move. I will force on you. Move now. Move now. Hello. Hello. Hey. 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 Sensitive. Diego. So, what did the man say when he had the balance? Igor was shocked. Likewise, Lola. But it is natural. Hmm. The, the problem now is what do we do? Huh? 
How can you ask that question? That's what we decided before coming here. The letter seeing him, we go to the officers to get him bailed out. That's what we're going to do. Ah, I have myself to blame. Please, nobody should blame my children. I did not play the role of a father to my children. That's why I am in this mess. Oh no, it's okay. This when we get out of here, when you go home, you can do that. But meanwhile, don't stress yourself up. Be careful. We we'll make sure you come out of here. Yes. You can be one no a fully cell and set on. You were elected to run the affairs of the community, not fully cell. Yes. Because you don't lament when you go home, you know. So how uh, oh, was the Igwe? Uh, how you see how is his health now? Well, there is no problem with Igwe's health. He is fine. God, okay. Miko, how is he in your condition? Let's go and see the officers. Thank you. He must be. He must be. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh, What's up, babe? Uncle. Have you checked on that young man this morning? No, I have not. It's too early for a big fast. Okay. I will have to check up on him then. Okay. Ah, yes, I forgot. Um, is there a number? Not yet. I shall know that you said the last prayer. Hmm? Talk you say the last prayer. Don't do what? <laughs> Are you kidding me? You're actually begging me. Hmm? Hmm? You know what? Lady B asked me to personally rip your brains off. Sorry. So now that you to join your access course. So, how is the handsome guy? Handsome guy? Don't tell me you have an eye on him, just as I have an eye on you. You're kidding, right? Of course not, babe. I mean, I'm all alone. That's really big. But we're here to do our job. Forget about the job. It's you that I want. I can't believe that six sous could go to the excess of putting you in a police cell. My dear, look at me. Just look at me. I'm in a police cell. Six tools has taken enough for the owner not to move. Today, I think you're not sent to. Come on. You don't need to convince me of your innocence. I know you don't do this. But the most important thing now is how to how to get you out of this place. Yes. Should I get your parents there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, don't even mention my parents. Yeah. And I don't even want them to know about this thing, eh? See, babe, the best thing now, I think I need a lawyer. A very good one. A lawyer? Yes. 
It's okay. Mm -hmm. Don't no worry. I'll do my best to get you out of this place, okay? Thank you. Don't leave me. The time is over. So you're leaving me. It's okay. Here. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Good day, sir. Yes, good day. My name is Anita, Pamela's friend. Sir, I've come here on behalf of my friend Pamela. She's innocent of the crime she's been accused of. And she's really suffering that police, sir. Please, sir. You've got to show her mercy for the sake of God. Please. Have you finished? Well, I do not have your time. As you can see, I was on my way out. You are so far from here. What is it? <sighs> so Madina, it's about your brother, Otito. I'm not comfortable that he is alone in the village. I will go back and take care of him. Mama, why don't you just forget about Otito for now? Since he has chosen to go with Papa, let him stay back there and run his life. Huh? Moreover, Otito is a big boy now and can take care of himself. Do you say that I should forget about my only son? Do you actually know what you're saying? Otito is my only son. And I cannot leave him all alone in the village. I'm going back there tomorrow to take care of him. Okay, Mama. If you insist, just know that I'm not coming with you. Yes, I insist. Please, stay back. I don't even need you. How can I forget my only son? No, what am I doing in the, in the city? What am I doing here for God's sake? What's up? Not Why is your face like this? You guys have not impressed him one bit. Hmm? What does it take to capture him? Just one man. How am I even spending money on you guys? Tell me. Oh, Lady B, I quite understand your plight. No, you don't. You don't understand my plight. But I assure you that soon. That idiot. That fool. I mean, that Casanova that called himself Mr. Sisu Songo's will be captured like a fool and brought to you. Lady B, take my word. You don't need to worry yourself over this issue. Allow me to do my job. I mean, me and my men will launch an open attack on that idiot. Lady B, as far as I'm concerned, Sisu doesn't have a son here. I'm going to sign them! Sadwala. I believe you can't afford to fail me this time. Sure, sure. Huh? And remember, I need him alive and unharmed. Consider it done, <laughs> let it be. I am there! I am there! I won't know what's wrong in both of them. So good. The lady believes that our best is not good enough. She's not happy because of our delay to bring down Mr. Sisu Sonu Zurika down. And I want each and every one of us here 
to prove to her that we are professionals in this game. Am I understood? Yes, boss. Good. I had. Yes. We can't afford to fail her this time around. Remember, we have only two fucking days. Two days to deliver that idiot to her. Am I understood? Yes, boss. Good. Boy, if I may ask, boss. I thought our initial plan with her was to get the young man kidnapped. Why did she suddenly change her mind? And now, we are asked to get his father as well. Miss Chattel, I'm not in a position to answer you that question. We must complete this mission. I repeat to myself, we must complete this mission. Am I understood? Yes, boss. Get your weapons ready. Yes, boss. Stay here. No. have been trying their best. What disturbs me really is your mother and your sisters. I didn't know they could go this far. Oh, son, it saddens me. Honestly, father, they did not do it the right way. They did not do it the right way at all. Even if you offended them, is it not high time they forgave you? After all, our Lord Jesus Christ died for our sins just to grant us freedom. Son, you're right. That is the spirit. Christ died and forgave us. So we must forgive one another. Yes. Son, let us not blame them all the way. I failed as a father. Oh, how I wish we can all come back as one happy family. One happy family. Son. Come bring it back. 
bring them back, son. Your mother, your sister, bring them back. Bring them back. Mama? Where are you coming back from? I went to look after Papa at the police station. Mama, I can't believe you can be this heartless. I can't believe you can be this heartless even to your own husband. Otito, watch your words. I didn't come here to receive insult from you. I just came back to take care of you because my conscience will not allow me to leave you all alone in the village. You are just talking this way because you... You did not know what your father did to me. Nonsense. Please. I am begging you. You just have to forgive my father. He told me at the police station that he is regretting all that he did to you and my sisters in the past. He also told me that he failed you as a husband. Mama, we just have to come back together again as one happy family. You won't understand, son. Your father is such a terrible human being. He knows what happened to him. And even if I forgive him, your sisters can never forgive him. Mama, forgive him first. Forgive him. If you do, together we will go to my sister's and plead on his behalf. Mama, think about what the villagers might be saying about us now. Okay. In case you've forgotten, let me remind you. You and my father wedded in the church as Christians. And up there at the altar, you promised to spend the rest of your life with him. For better, for worse, Mama. In sickness and in health, Mama. Mama, where is your husband? <laughs> The old one is out there suffering. Where is, where is your husband? Where is your husband, Mama? Where is your husband? Where is your husband? <laughs> My dear, there is nothing much you will always let the police say. Although I heard that Dojito, his son, is not siding with his daughters. Ono will soon be released. Because Igwe and the in council are doing everything possible to calm the storm, my dear. Hey! Oh, Jesus! Wonder shall never end. Oh, how far have you gone? I went to see sisters. I tried to convince him of your innocence, but he didn't give me the slightest attention. You did? Yeah. You shouldn't have. My dear, what could I have done? Huh? It's obvious we can't settle war with war. We can only do so by making peace. That's just what I was trying to do. But when that plan failed, I resorted to our prior arrangement on getting a lawyer. She got the lawyer? <laughs> oh my god! Hey, thank you very much. I'm fine. All that I've done without you, eh? We're making arrangements. Hey! Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. God bless you.
God bless you. Okay, hey, I'm fine. Your father thinks he can escape us. Don't you tell me? If he tries to escape my men one more time, believe me, I will crush you! Do you understand? I will crush you! Rubbish! Can you imagine? Did you hear what she said? She said, one more time. Yes, one more time. I am there! Looking at the whole situation from a different angle. Why don't we go and pacify your family? But even if it means condescending. Because you cannot continue to be here. Here is not your home. Let's go talk to your wife and children. Biko. I just want to thank you. Hey. You have tried. You have tried for me. Yeah, I have mm. no choice. My son, Rotito, as a matter of fact, I, he is doing something in that direction. Okay. Mm. Okay. I have won him over to my side. Good. Good. Um, I don't know. Maybe uh, you will make him smile if you. You can get uh, some elders. I'll and, uh, go and pick some of them. Uh, I'll pick some elders. Yes, go we go to the city. Whatever pain, whatever thing it will cost us, we go there. We go. We are robbing. Hey, what? I don't know what I'm going to This is the reason why you sent for me, Mama. I can't believe you allow Ochitu to deceive you into believing that Papa has no hand in this. Mama, are you the one talking or is someone talking through you? Nobody is talking through me, Somadina. I saw reason with Ochitu. It is true that your father is a wicked man. That we should not allow him to suffer so much for a crime he did not commit. Sister So, remember that that same day the incident happened. Papa wasn't even aware that all of you will be coming back home on that same day. Now tell me, what time did he even have? to plan the kidnap. I hope you are not referring to me, Ojitu. Then mention my name there again, eh? Or land the heavy slap on that your tiny cheeks. Ta -ta 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 -ta. Anyway, I don't care if Papa has a hand in this or not. My major concern is that he's getting his due from Nemesis. He can't. In fact, I'm happy that he's languishing in the police cell. Come. What? Where? Okay. Okay. Along Potakot Expressway. We will be there. We will be there. Inspector Hyde! Right. 
Get the boys ready. Ebibi has just escaped from the hands of the kidnappers and they're after him. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I think you are coming with you. I am coming with you. Hey, boy. Lady Bella, so it has been you all this while. It has been you, the big head, all this, all this while. Yes. It has been me, and I don't regret it. Officer, while we were in school, this idiot was dating me and my elder sister at the same time, unknown to us, because we were in different school. He later got my elder sister pregnant and exiled to abort it. While all these things was happening, I was already three months pregnant for him. I can't believe this. Sisters, did you do all that? Woman, shut up and listen. Go on, little girl. <sighs> My sister went to have an abortion. She died during the process. Sisters here did the same thing to me. When I told him about my own pregnancy, he rejected me and asked me to abort it. <sighs> Which I did successfully. <sighs> he later left school before me. And I discovered that it was the cause of the death of my elder sister. I vowed, I vowed to come for him. Revenge was all I wanted. <laughs> Sweet revenge. May God. Please, tell me that you know nothing about what this woman is talking about. Tell me that is not true, please. Officer. My intention was to kill every member of his family, starting from his son here. I later changed my mind. I wanted to capture Sisus so that he would be the one to shoot his son forcefully. Then I'll kill him. <laughs> That's all, officer. Officers, lock this woman up! I said lock this woman up! Criminal! You just met your hotel. Wait, wait, wait. Please, I beg you. Please, let us go back inside. Be cool. No. Sisters, I never believed you could be this heartless. What has happened? See, it, that was in the past. All she was talking about was in the past. I am a changed man now. At least you can vouch for me. You can vouch for me. It will be talk to your mother. Mom, please. I'm not going back there. I've had enough already. Beat me at home. Yeah. Okay. Inspector Life. Sure, sir. Easy. Now that the truth is out, make arrangements on how to release the Pamela girl. It's okay, sir. I've already started making arrangements for that, sir. Good. I will see you when I come back. Sure, sir. Easy. So I get both from coast to coast every day.
So like you to forgive me for accusing you wrong. Oh, no, I have. Hey, Bube. Grandpa. Hey, Bube, Mama. Yeah. Hey, yes, yes, yes. Welcome, Bube. Huh? Hi. <laughs> Hold on. Thank you. 